Okay guys, it's Strike for Freedom Stables here. And like I said in my last video, I was going to do some reviews of the 2021 models that I got while I was on vacation. So here is one of them. This is Old Glory, who's the patriotic horse this year. And he's really nice. I wish the um, silver was translucent, but it's not. But he is, and he is so pretty. I, I don't really like Esprit, but I like him as a decorator. So he's a really, he's a really cherry red and it's really pretty. And of course the blue is just drop dead gorgeous as well. I named mine, he doesn't have a name at the time of this recording. Um, but I think I'm going to name him American Victory. Um, so yeah, but he is really nice. I really like him. He is much darker than the other decorators that Briar has done. And I like that he has more red on him than the other ones. Um, he still has the bug eyes, which honestly, I wish they would have just left them red. But that's just me. He's got a hair on him. Sorry, he's dusty already. Um... He's really nice. He has a little bit of a flaw there on the star. But it's not that big of a deal to me. And then on his offside, he, like I said, is just really dusty. But I really like him. His hooves are painted as well. They're not um, translucent. But I really like the ombre in his tail, how it fades to the clear. I really like that. He's probably my favorite of the many that they've done of um, Patriot, Illumination, and now this one. Although they've done Allegiance, which is a stable mate for the stable mate club. And they did Born to Run as like a red, white, and blue, or red and blue, really, decorator for Briarfest. Off to the races, I believe. So yeah, this is him. I would recommend getting him. Even if you don't really like the mold, because I can't stand the Esprit mold. But I just really, really, really like how he's done. So yeah, that's Old Glory. Thank you guys. Bye.